So what we want to do is we want to start with a number system and then build all the bigger ones whose symmetry groups have this commutativity property. And that's what Hilbert really asked for. So if I start with any number system, how do I build all the ones that are bigger than it such that when you look at the symmetries, they commute with each other. Commuting means that A times B is B times A. So how do you build all the symmetries, uh, all the number systems that have that property? It was um, frustrating. I had, some of the, I had some of the initial ideas to prove what we proved, you know, 10 years ago, uh, 15 years ago, I would say like, um, well, not 15, but I would say 10 years ago, I had some of the initial ideas that we used to prove this but I just couldn't make it work. There were several really important ingredients that didn't have, you know, the landscape changes as you're working on these problems. So you might, and that's why you need to keep learning and going to seminars and reading about work of others, because uh, at some point there'll, there'll be tools that show up that you can then add to your arsenal to attack the problem you really care about.